Hey my lovelies and welcome back to the acne channel. In today's video I am going to be talking to you all about the activated charcoal mask, who's it for, how to use it and the benefits. This is one of my favourite go-to masks for when I am experiencing a breakout and I just need something to calm it down a little bit. So as you can see I currently have a breakout along here that's formed together in a little group. They're all friends now. And this is what the rest of my face looks like. So here we have the hyperpigmentation and the scarring. So it looks like marks, but it's smooth, it's soft. It's just the, deep, the marks that have been left behind from the deep cystic spots. And then I don't know if you can see, but I've also been suffering with blackheads as well. So this mask is going to target those areas, it's going to target the blackheads and it's going to target the blemishes as well. That is the main concerns that this mask will, will target. So here we have the product, you get 25ml and it comes in a powder form like this, I don't know if you can see. And one of the main reasons that I love this mask is because it contains natural ingredients. So it doesn't contain any sulfates, any silicones, any dyes, any fragrance, any of those sorts of ingredients that are gonna irritate the skin and that can make it more red or can even cause any more breakouts. So I'm just gonna take half a teaspoon of the mask. You can mix it with the vitamin C spray if you have this. You can also mix a little bit of it with water. I'm gonna mix it with apple cider vinegar. So apple cider vinegar, one of the more natural remedies to clearing up spots. And it's also really good for reducing age spots and hyperpigmentation as well. I just pour it into the cap and then pour it into this dish here. You only need a tiny little bit of this mask, like a tiny amount goes such a long way. So I just keep on mixing it until it comes to a paste-like formula, like so. And this mask is targeted at, at normal skin types and it's also suitable for combination and oily skin. So I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this to my face. I'm just gonna apply a thin layer. And one of the main key ingredients in this mask, hence the name, is charcoal. And charcoal, I actually find this a really good ingredient for acne prone skin. It really works to pull out any impurities and excess oil from the skin. The only thing I would say is that when you mix it with the apple cider vinegar, it's really strong. I can like really mix my eyes up. I want to get the nose because I want to make sure that I'm targeting them blackheads. Okay, now I'm looking a little bit crazy. So once you've applied it evenly all over the face, you want to leave it on for 10 minutes and then you can wash it off. So I will be back with you in 10 minutes. So just a few minutes into the mask, you will notice that the skin starts to feel really tight and the mask will start to dry you'll start to see areas like here where you can sort of see where it pulls out any impurities and you can really feel it getting to work so i always like it when you put on a mask and you can actually feel feel it working, you can feel it doing something. I just wanted to mention a few benefits of the apple cider vinegar. It is an alpha hydroxy acid, so it does work to exfoliate the skin. It also helps balance out the skin's pH level. 
and it can also remove dead skin cells and dry up any active spots and this is due to it being antibacterial and antifungal and this is because it is also I think it's acetic acid and lactic acid and malic acid so it does have properties that work to fight against any acne causing bacteria. So once all of the mask has dried up you can go ahead and wash it off and you can see even clearer now the areas in which it has pulled out any impurities you can see them so yeah i'm just gonna go and wash this off so i have now washed the mask off and when removing the mask you will notice that your face will appear red this is completely normal and it will go down within the next day and after you've finished applying the mask and you've washed it off you want to follow this up with your favourite moisturiser. I'm just going to use the Vanish Vitamin C cream because I know this one is kind to my skin and doesn't break me out. I feel like it's crazy how red it actually does make your skin go. I think that's because the charcoal actually stimulates the blood flow as well. There we go, so that is the finished result. I'm gonna check in with you again in the morning so that you can see what my skin looks like once the redness has calmed down. So it is the next morning and as you can see, the redness has completely faded and gone down. So I hope you enjoyed this video and please let me know in the comments your favorite acne breakout treatment. Have a nice day.